Hey, today we are in Golfmark 7 with uh, Discover Media um, navigation system. This is the MIP2 generation, and uh, I'm going to uh, I'm going to try to guide you how to update your navigation maps. The good news is that this system is still covered by Volkswagen, and you are uh, allowed to update it for free legally. So if someone uh, someone is charging you for those updates, uh, you got scammed. So first, let's go to navigation and settings. And over here we have uh, version information. We can see that we have the East and Central Europe 2015-16. So those maps are already four years, four years old. So how to update? When you press the update button, you can see that the system is looking for an uh, update source and there's no update source at the moment in the car. So what we are going to do is open the glove box and over here you have the head unit. And uh, by the way, this is just the screen and the uh, button sets. The actual head unit is this thing over here often mistaken with the CD changer. This is actually the head unit. So over here we have an SD card and once I remove it we can see that the um, map source is not available at the moment. So we are going to take this, put it into the computer, download the um, Volkswagen Discover Care software and we should be able to update this, uh, this uh, set of maps uh, for free if you have a good uh, internet connection, this shouldn't take long, so let's uh, check it out. Okay, we are done with the update. It took about two and a half hours and right now I'm turning on the system. I have the card over here, the lock is on, navigation is starting and there's no data. So let's plug it in, let's put the card in the system. Okay. System found it and let's hope that this will not take much longer because it's late right now. And it's working. As you can see over here, we have the East and Central Europe 2020. So this is the latest map at the moment. If you want to update your navigation system, go to the uh, website uh, that uh, Volkswagen provides for you. There's a link in the description below this video. And uh, you need to download software for your computer. It's available, available for both Mac and Windows operating system. And when you plug your SD card to your computer, it will guide you through the whole process. You have to just click next a few times and wait two, two and a half hours for the new maps to be downloaded and installed on the SD card. Okay, thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like this tutorial and uh, subscribe for future ones. See you soon.